let's give it a final stir fry. So this is a recipe for a dry garlic spirit, just like the way we used to make it at my grandfather's restaurant and my dad's restaurant. So this is a popular dish. The only difference is that we add some onions. So why do I add onions? Because I bought a big bag of onions on sale. But we're going to add the onions. It's going to give it some flavor. It's a, onions are aromatic. Now you can order the products and ingredients that I use in my cooking videos. Just click the link below in the description for the Chinese cooking accessory guide. So first of all we're going to just put in about three tablespoons of cooking oil. I have the peanut oil. So I'm going to leave it at uh, medium to high heat. And I got, a, I got about a tablespoon of uh, chopped ginger. The original recipe we didn't use the uh, ginger. But for this type of cooking I like to add ginger. It's an aromatic. It brings out flavor. And then I have uh, three tablespoons of chopped uh, garlic. You can put more garlic if you like, or less. That's up to you. And I got a small onion. Like I said, I have lots of onions, so I'm gonna put some onions in there. So that's a small onion I put in there. So I just uh, stir fry that for a few seconds. I have about a pound of uh, spare ribs, pork spare ribs that cut up into uh, small pieces. I simmered it in water for about half an hour just to tenderize the uh, spare ribs. So sometimes you might have to do it longer. So now I'm just going to turn the uh, heat on to high. I'm going to put about a teaspoon of salt. So this is the uh, sea salt. You can use regular salt if you like. So there's different ways of making this recipe. It's just uh, this is the way it was made at our restaurant many years ago. So I learned to uh, make this uh, recipe from uh, Chef Tom, who was uh, one of the best uh, stir fry. Uh, took in the city so he said nobody will admit to being number one but he'll admit to being number two so that's his way of saying that he's one of the best or if not the best so now I'm just going to put some uh, light soy sauce so I'm just going to hit it a couple tablespoons And then I'm going to put a couple tablespoons of this uh, dark soy sauce. Dark soy sauce has more color. So just uh, put a few drops of water in there just before you take off the stereo, just to give it a little moisture. So I got about uh, maybe uh, three tablespoons of water. So let's give it a final stir fry. So the water just uh, keeps the uh, favorite moist. So one of my viewers uh, had this in a restaurant, so I'm trying to make it as authentic as I can, based on uh, my memory of this. Uh, this uh, dish, so I'm going to take it off right now. There you have it, a simple tasty recipe. It's our version of dry garlic spare ribs. Enjoy. The recipes you get now is the what I call stay at home recipes. This is what I have in my fridge and if you have any suggestions uh, let me know. Uh, put it in the comments in the section below and be sure to give me a, a like and uh, 
be sure to subscribe and uh, make sure you uh, click the bell so I can uh, keep giving you more videos.